Hello everyone, my name is Rachel Wilson. <laughs> hello, my, hello everyone, my name is Rachel Wilson and I am supporting Donald J. Trump as my president. <laughs> the liberals stole the election. <laughs> Uh, that's real, Cam. That's real. And I'm here to publicly defend myself against the false groomer. I was thinking that, Kobe. Claims. The situation has escalated to a false claims. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Let's hear it. My family, my friends, and my career. I'm here to clear my name and talk about the logical facts and evidence. This screenshot from a group chat was edited and blurred to make me look like I don't have clothes. To be honest, I might need her. Goes on January 2023. I wore a pink bunny girl cosplay to an anime convention, and I shared the photos of my. Oh, bro! I need, I need a, I need a fucking will response, dude. I need my shit to turn up. I need, I need my shit. Oh my god, bro! That would, that would crank my numbers. So I'm getting hard thinking about. It. Let me back up a little bit here. That's a joke, obviously. I mean, it would do numbers, but actually, I'd rather that dude just stay off the internet. I wore a pink bunny girl cosplay to an anime convention, and I shared the photos of my new cosplay to this group chat. These are the original photos, a back picture of the bunny cosplay, and a front picture of the cosplay with a cat sleeping on my lap. This is my pet cat, Basil. The narrative- Um, listen, brother. I know how this shit works, okay? I know how this shit works, brother. Okay, no, 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 no. As a former little Christian boy, okay, these are not. This isn't. These aren't photos that you send your friends as a Christian. Okay, these are. Uh, these are spicy photos. Also, the lip bite. You're trying to be like, oh yeah, I was just feeling cute with my cats. The lip bite. Nah, dude. Nah, I don't believe it. You're sending these to 15 year olds. I don't believe it, dude. What was the context? Zelda, you're so thirsty. Basil misses you, honey. Uh, honey group chat these are the original photos a back picture of the bunny cosplay and a front picture of the cosplay with a cat sleeping on my lap this is my pet cat basil yeah she's trying to get in some people's holies if you know what i'm saying the narrative told was i explicitly sent pictures to a 15 year old when i only shared cosplay is that a thin blue line flag behind her i'm just kidding it looks like an american flag with the fucking blue line on it it picks to a group chat of five i don't know what your background is lady but that shit it's ass bro Girls, just want to let you know including me. not that mine's better you know Fucking unfinished ass house. This group chat included three girls my same age that were my close friends at the time and a 15 year old girl. No. No. No, the con. No. No. We'll, re we'll review the comments in a few. I was not close with. I did not make this group chat called Turkey Cemetery, and the group chat was not my idea. You see bunny girl cosplays at Comic Cons and worn outside in public. I believe they. Okay, yeah, there we go. All right, now we're now we're fucking now we're hitting the now we're hitting the. Well, actually, these pictures are tame compared to more revealing pictures from other girls in the community. Maddie and Om. <laughs> me doctored photos of me to look like I don't have clothes on. That is defamation of character. These <laughs> that is defamation of character. No, brother. He was fucking blurring your ass and boobs, brother. Uh, chill out. These people did not communicate about these group chat issues before they went public. Yeah, dude, you're being sexual. Yes, dude, of course they didn't communicate. Fuck. All screenshots were taken completely Oh, bro, out. I can I can literally already feel this. this is, I'm about to get... Yo, somebody's gonna be like, well, you got ratioed because I'm gonna fucking post this video on the VODs channel. Motherfuckers are gonna be like, well, actually, okay. So actually, you dumbass, you've never had contact with a woman before. This is not being overly sexual. Let's forget everything else wrong that she did. She's not being sexual, okay? She was simply fucking showing her almost entire boobs and her ass to 15-year-olds because it was her cosplay. Do you not understand these fucking horrible people at these cosplay conventions where even worse context under the video someone asked maddie show unblurred proof maddie's response was i'm not posting photos like that of her because i know she wouldn't want them out there and i have basic human decency basic human decency maddie you and ami knew i was in a pink bunny girl cosplay with my pet cat and you blurred the photos people have been asking for the leaked nudes online I'm sorry to disappoint you, but they do not exist. Someone else commented on the video, where is the proof of the 15-year-old girl? Because there is an actual proof that who she sent the message to was 15. Maddie's response was, because I was in the group. She, she liked them. She liked the comment. Okay, but to be fair, friends do those face expressions. If you, like, you dress cute, you make a cute face and it's sexy, then you make that face. It's to commit to the fit. Yeah, but also, like, yeah, I mean, I get that as, like, friends, like, full-ass adult friends, but, like, being like, oh, yeah, this seems, uh, 
this seems good to send to the group chat of 15 year olds the group chat and i know the 15 year old personally then they responded back but there isn't any evidence and there's no way she's using like these crazy like zero like comments one could say that i agree there is no logical facts or evidence because all the screenshots were edited and fabricated out of respect for this 15 year old her name will stay anonymous considering ami and maddie are only using her as a prop to frame me for grooming i never sent anything privately to this 15 year old i was not close with this person I have no interest in minors. This is just a group chat between five girls. And what do friends do in a group chat? They joke around and act silly. I believe the situation could have been handled privately and maturely, but these people felt the need to publicly humiliate me and destroy my brand. I am sorry to the people who took these screenshots out of context, but these grooming allegations will not be taken lightly. These grooming allegations will not be taken lightly. Only God can cancel me. I would like to address this. Your Honor? We were just being girly pops in the group chat. Stolen artwork accusations. My ex-boyfriend claims I stole artwork from him. Nobody, we're not talking about this, lady. In 2022, he drew fan art of me for a song release and gave me permission to sell the artwork. We had a verbal contract between us. The agreement was I pay him $50 for the commission to own the artwork. Here's a receipt of me sending him $50 through PayPal and me receiving the commission as a transaction in 2022. He also gave me permission to sell the artwork over text. I messaged him. I remember you gave me the price of $50 for the song cover. Why is that edited? That's a pretty decent price, but then again, all the coloring, shading, and stuff, that should be extra. His response was, yeah, and I still feel bad about it. The context of that response is he felt like the price of $50 was too high to charge me when we were together. I messaged him, I make bulk of the artwork prints and sign and sell them for autographs at conventions, and I could say I bought the art from you so I could do whatever I want with it. We, we do not care. He responded, that's true. It's yours to sell now. My ex-boyfriend and I had a really bad falling out in February 2023. This led us to cutting ties, but this is confirmation I own the artwork and I have permission. Your Honor, my client was just a gorilla in a fucking cape. Permission to sell it? That's just business. Your Honor, were you there? Your Honor, if I was lying, wouldn't my pants be on fire? Case closed. Business. Your Honor, she's just a girl. I am not racist. I do not discriminate. I love all people of color, nationality and ethnicities my best friend josh also known as jolly boy josh is a person of color <laughs> <laughs> there's no way there's no way i have a black friend <laughs> i have a black friend there's no way she used that card oh sis you ate sis you ate you ate this is a dope you apology video. Um, Your Honor, nah, -uh, I have a black friend. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's nice. You love all those people. Do you love gay people and trans people, though? Wondering, just wondering about that. And my workout partner, he has been shown in multiple videos of mine. I have black friends. I am not racist. I'm just silly. I literally have only said the N word about 20 times this last week. And handles me at Comic Cons. <laughs> Next, I want Oh, brother. Oh, brother. I need to see this again. Cons. Hold on, I need to hear the info, though. What does he do at Comic Cons? Is a person of color and my workout partner. He has been shown in multiple videos of mine and handles me at Comic Cons. Handles her? Handles her? I know we covered the video about the dog girl the other day. Is that what we're getting into here? <laughs> Next, I want to address the Zionist accusation. I am not a Zionist. I am only a fan of the popular voice actress Tara Strong. My content is- Bro, nobody, nobody is accusing you of this never been about politics. I was unaware of people calling her a Zionist until I posted a video of us together. But this accusation is not true. I am not a uh, Okay, Link, that makes sense. Ableist. I have disabled loved ones, like my childhood best friend. Oh, I thought she said I disabled loved ones. I was like, she killed a motherfucker? 
What? Angelina. She is diagnosed with EDS and POTS, okay. hypermobile and vascular Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, and postular orthostatic tachycardia syndrome. She has been my Mother, family friend for over 13 years. To this day, we still constantly hang out and go to church together. I was a disabled kid in elementary school. I used a wheelchair and crutches while fighting a rare knee disease called osteochondritis desiccans throughout elementary school. I am not homophobic or transphobic. I have LBGTQ plus friends and loved ones. Oh, okay, here we go. Uh, again, I, uh, yo, <clears throat> my friend's black. And as a person, I love all people. I also respect all religions, and I believe having personal faith is a beautiful thing. I tried my best to reconcile and make amends with these people, but they felt like it was necessary to go public and slander me with false allegations. Early 2023, the falling out with Ami and Maddie and my first breakup with my boyfriend was the lowest time in my life. That's when God put it on my heart to get baptized. September 2023. I and I'm glad we can bring it back around to God. Yep. I gave my life to Jesus. I'd like to share my testimony. I'm very grateful. No way. There is no way. There's no way. <laughs> this is crazy. It all came back around to my faith. Holy shit. Listen, again, no fucking hate. No hate to religious people. Um, No hate to religious people. Anyone that is religious, I consider myself spiritual. It's I don't, I don't fault you for believing in God. I just think it's fucking, a lot of times like this is corny as fuck and also not needed. Uh, and also the fact that this person's like, ha yeah, I sent sexual images to minors. Yep. I wasn't naked though. And, uh, guess what? I don't, I'm not racist because I have a black friend and I'm not transphobic because I have, I have gay friends. So cooked. Ha <laughs> ha Look at my baptism. Let me tell my testimony. I'm also very grateful to my best friend, Angelina. Your honor, I'm on a quest. She's always been there for me and she's also got me closer to God. I feel closest to Jesus through music and prayer. I've always known I was going to be a performer. And since I was very young, I want to uplift God with my talents, praising him through the gifts he's blessed me with. I struggled a lot with different relationships, but God has got me through it all. I choose to love everyone. And when I choose, and when I choose forgiveness and gratitude over anger and resentment, I feel the most at peace. I believe this is genuine, right? Because, like, when you're fucking, like, so, like, you think that you found, um, when you feel like you found some higher power, you think that, like, everything is fucking changed. Not that, uh, you know, finding a higher form of whatever it doesn't, but, like, you know, I don't know, dude. I think this is in bad taste to share this after an allegation. Uh, my personal take. Your Honor, God told me to be sexual towards 15-year-olds. Yo, Evo, yeah, dude. I wonder if this is how P. Diddy's gonna do it. Here's my testimony. I feel like knowing God is the ultimate happiness. That's why I choose to get baptized. Can we get her a lav mic, please? Oh my god. Damn, shorty, you Yo, Evo, me? what's up, dude? Thank you for stopping in on the stream. I didn't realize you were new. Thank you so much for being here. How'd you find the stream if you don't mind asking? As a kid-friendly content creator, I believe it's my moral responsibility to post clean content. I've stated my values before. I do not drink, smoke, do drugs, curse, and I'm also saving myself from marriage. I understand my life will never be. <laughs> okay, crazy, crazy info to share there. Okay. Be the same from the situation. I put my. She's very kid friendly. In Jesus, and I'm confident in God's plan for my life. Thank you to my supporters, my friends. This is this is all of God's plan. And family who have been there for me through this tough situation. God bless you all. Hello, everyone. My. Okay, let's review the comments, please. Uh, now that is an apology video. I didn't even switch up. Switched. I didn't even switch up. I WS on no one's side. Crying emoji, prayer emoji. Damn, she called y'all out. Crying emoji, prayer emoji. Of course we're switching up. She proved her innocence. She did not let that slide. Let her cook, y'all. I have never gasped so so loud. She actually ate that up. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't switch up because I didn't. 
even know what was happening, Scalamoji. Proud Freckle Zelda defender since the start. This is quite level... What is... I don't... Okay, I'm too old for that. This this is how to make an apology slash defense video. Guys, it's not an apology video. She said sorry for nothing. She stood on business. She barked back, crying emoji, crying emoji, crying emoji. She, she ate, she ate up, y'all. Crying emoji, crying emoji. Freckle Zelda really stood up, crying emoji, heart emoji. Now that is how you do an apology, apologizing video. She snapped back. That's just business. She didn't, didn't sweep. She mopped. Pro is talking like a lawyer. The way I found this on a accident, but she's really standing on business. She in the clean comeback gang with. I don't know who the fuck that is. <laughs> Imagine an Obama voice. Is there anyone being like, yeah, so uh, I don't fuck with us. You forgot your ukulele. <laughs> best one. This is the best apology video I've seen yet. My name's Rachel Wilson, the person behind the character Freckled Zelda, and I'm here to publicly defend myself against the false groomer accusations and false claims. The situation has escalated to affecting my family, my friends, and my career. A random vod of yours popped up on YouTube. I liked your content. I decided to drop in. Yo, Evo, you're so fucking real for that. I appreciate you a ton. I'm here to clear my name and talk about the logical facts and evidence. This screenshot from a group chat was edited and blurred to make me look like- Okay, sorry. I'll <laughs> I'm just trying to fucking grasp this, dude. Holy fuck, bro. Holy fuck. I, I don't get it, dude. I don't. Um, This shit is crazy. I feel like, again, like, the main thing is, like, she was sexual with minors. She's like, oh, I'm not racist or transphobic because, uh, because I have, uh, LGBTQ members or LGBTQI plus members in my life and black people in my life. She said... Like, she's not homophobic or transphobic, but she's probably doing the same shit that a lot of these, like, very, like, outward, like, conservative Christians do, where she's like, um, she's like, oh, I don't hate them, I hate the sin. AKA, she like, hey, I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm not saying for sure, but that kind of sounds like what it is, considering the fact that she responded to that person, uh, saying that they were agnostic, saying, I'll pray for you, uh, it kind of sounds like that's very similar to where her headspace is. Maybe she'll be better in the future. We don't know. Um, yeah, dude. I don't know, dude. If you said, I'm not racist. I got black friends. Then dropped a black guy, and I can't help but imagine it with an MLG edit. 